Good morning. Today is Tuesday, May 12th. Your super secret word is love. Love. I think we've had that one before, but I like that word. All right. So we're going to go over our history test. And this, of course, is many of the things that I said yesterday during our video. I want you to do your best to try to recall what we talked about yesterday. Okay. Columbia is the river that is located between what two states? Do you remember? Washington and Oregon. Columbia River. Okay. I'll try to do them a little more out of order and see if I can keep them straight. Okay. Yesterday we learned about this dog, Balto. Do you remember what Balto is famous for? He rescued a bunch of children. And they celebrate that by having a race. What's the name of the race? I did a rod. I did a rod. It runs from Anchorage to where? Nome, Alaska. Takes two or three weeks to win that race. Where is the Golden Gate Bridge? Oh, that's so tough. Can you remember? Can you remember? California. Crater Lake. Crater Lake is the what? Biggest lake? Tiniest lake? Saltiest lake? No, it is the deepest lake in the United States. There was this beautiful picture. Okay, what is Silicon Valley known for? What are these things? Computers. Silicon Valley is known for computers. Washington is home to what computer company? Microsoft. Who made the first personal computer? I'm about to show it. Can you remember who made the first personal computer? The Apple computer. The first personal computer. Whoops. Okay, Queen Lily. She was the last royal ruler of what state? Hawaii. Okay, there were two gold rushes in particular. I think there were more, but that we learned about. California and Alaska, they each had a gold rush. Which one began at Sutter's Mill? That would be California. <laughs> And which one caused Alaska to be settled? That was the Klondike Gold Rush. It caused many people to come and make their home there. And what year were Alaska and Hawaii made states? In 1959. My dad was two years old. Were your parents even alive? Here's the Boeing 747. Quick, how many people can ride a Boeing 747? 5,000? 2,000? 10? How many? 500. And how many cars can fit on its wing? 45. 45 medium sized cars. Who is Barack Obama? the first African-American to be elected president who worked with the people with Hansen's disease. I see it written right here. Leprosy, Hansen's disease. You remember the name of the man? He built a church on a place in Hawaii on an island. His name was, you ready, you ready, you ready? Father Damien. Father Damien. Beverly Cleary wrote two books that were mentioned. Do you remember the names of them? Beezus and Ramona and Ribsy. Walt Disney, he created Mickey Mouse and what full length animated musical? Snow White and the Seven Dwarfs. I don't know why they're not called dwarves because I thought, oh well. All right, and we are, oops, I'm going backwards. All right. Wow, what did I do? 
Hang on. There we go. What is this picture? Oh, I just told you. Washington, apple orchard. Washington is known for its apples. What state has is a leading producer of kiwi fruit, olives, and strawberries? California is. Very good if you knew that. The Aurora Borealis is a name for what? The Northern Lights. And Death Valley, California is so cold, people freeze to death there every year, right? Oh wait, never mind. That's the hottest place on the planet, right? Where the hottest recorded temperature, especially in the United States, Death Valley, California. All right, the Pacific Rim of Fire. Do you remember what that is? See how these continents all make a rim around the Pacific? It has 90% of the world's earthquakes there. What were three volcanoes I had you memorize? Mauna, um, the Wakayo, how does that one go? And Mount St. Helens, Kilauea, wow, I was way off. Kilauea, Kilauea, Mauna or Mauna Loa, and Mount St. Helens. Which one is not a volcano, but a tall mountain? Mount Denali, it's, <laughs> that sounds silly. I was going to say it's Donata Mountain. <laughs> that sounds ridiculous. Okay, and then we're back to Columbia River. All right, pray before you take your test and do your very best.